Good morning. If you hear the bins outside, it's because the restaurants are opening. It's early in the morning and they do the bins. And this is what happens in this flat. But, you know, doesn't matter. I'm getting used to it again. I lived with it for years, so bring it on. You'll hear the bottles being dumped in a moment. Part of urban living. Let's not start with a moan. Although, yes, autumn is on the way. And I... <sighs> I love the summer, I love summer clothes. I don't really like winter clothes because being very small, I get drowned in them. I like wearing summer stuff that is just one layer. But anyway, I want to talk about what I do, what changes in my wardrobe um, from the summer into the autumn and into the winter, and that is jeans. I never wear jeans in the summer, very seldom. I don't actually find jeans comfortable. When people say, oh, just wear a white T-shirt and a pair of jeans, I just think, actually, it's one of the most uncomfortable. Jeans, to me, denim, is not comfortable. Um, but I'm going to show you the jeans that I wear. The jeans that I wear at the moment, many of them you comment on, because they are quite extreme, some of them. Um, but also, going back to the jeans that I've worn over the years, I keep my jeans for years and years and years, and this is an admission. I seldom wash them. Now, I was told by a denim expert that came on my radio show years ago, try and wash your denim as few a times as possible because you literally wash the life out of it. So I have quite a few pairs of jeans, which means I rotate them. After I've worn them, I hang them up for days. I literally, if I can, I hang them outside just to air um, and I sponge anything that I've spilt on them off. I try never, I certainly never put them in a washing machine. If I am gonna wash them, I wash them by hand. But anyway, let's get going. I've got here some of my favorites, not all of the jeans I own. I'm gonna start off with the most recent purchases, going right the way back to jeans that I bought a long time ago, but I still wear for different occasions. So I am gonna start off with the wide-legged Mascob jeans. which have the frayed edges. Now these are a really soft denim, they're wide-legged, and I tend to wear them with a white t-shirt and with an acne pair of white pumps. Um, I would never wear them with a boot or a smart shoe. They are, because of the fringe bottom, they are really best with, as I say, a white pump, a white t-shirt, and maybe a cardigan um, over the top on these autumn days. So those are Mascob denims. My next pair of denims, every time I wear these in a vlog, I get so many comments. I've slept on my hair, by the way. Sorry, it's sticking up all over the place. These are dark, very dark, almost black denim. And these are by Ray, R-A-E-Y. This is, if you're familiar with matches, uh, matches have their own brand, which is Ray. And these, now just look at the leg on it. The, these are really wide legged. Again, I would wear these, they're very tight around the waist. I wear these with a casual shoe or I tell you what I am going to wear them with. Do you remember I bought some new sandals in the summer from Clairgerie? Uh, they are a 1970s style sandal. I would wear these sandals with these very wide legs. So it is pure 70s. Otherwise, I would wear them with a white pump. And again, I wear them with quite fancy tops. I wear them with silver lame tops and such like. My next pair of jeans are the jeans that I wear with my boots when I go for long walks or when I'm filming the Dogs in the City podcast. Practical. 
They are a stretch dark denim. They're by a brand called Edwin. And I got these, I've got like three pairs of these. They are amazing. I actually do put these in the, in the machine because they don't wash out. They, they don't really lose the color. They have got elasticin in them um, and they just fit the leg. They're very, they're tight drain pipe jeans that I wear with my boots when I go walking. Maybe an American vintage soft sweater, red sweater I often wear over the top. Um, and yes, these are from KJ's Laundry in Marylebone, where I get my Samantha Sung dresses. Um, I have, yes, two or three pairs of these, and they are really, really practical, and they're lovely to wear with big sweaters. Now, I always, these are very old jeans of mine, I always wanted a pair of J brand. Um, I remember people looking amazing in tight, really tight drain pipe jeans with a big belt, um, and flats, ballet pumps. Well, I tried to emulate that look and I looked rubbish, but I did buy my only pair of J brands. And these are incredibly tight. Um, I, they're the only jeans I've never actually had taken up. They just seem to fit my length of leg, which is unusual. Um, and I do wear these toward the dog. I just, I, they don't suit me, I'm too short, they're too tight, um, but they're J brand, they cost a fortune, so I will never get rid of them. Finally, I love my denim dungarees. I absolutely love them. Again, I get lots of comments when I wear these. These are almost black denim dungarees. They are massive. I like them really, really loose. They're by Toast. And I always, because they're very, what can I say, asexual, <laughs> I don't know. Um, I wear them with a high heel and an ankle sock. I don't know why, I just think it balances them out. Um, I don't look, want to look like a land army girl. Um, I roll up the bottoms, I've never ever had them taken up. And they are so useful. I wear them with a black roll neck sweater from uh, Walford. And um, I really love them, they are so useful. So there we go, I hope that, um, I'd love to know in the comments your favorite denim, what, you know, what, I go on and on about Fiorucci, my Fiorucci jeans, which I don't have any left now, but I'd love to know the denim that you still have, vintage denim maybe, and the denim that you now buy. And uh, yeah, autumn is upon us, so get the denim out, girls. I'll see you Sunday. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe. Please follow me on Instagram because I put lots of, um, no, I don't, but just follow me on Instagram because if you follow me on Instagram, I get a lot more attention from brands. I'm begging now, aren't I? See you Sunday. Bye. Oh, look at Matilda. She slept all the way through this. <laughs>